In 2006, the state of Texas established in El Paso the Texas A&M Transportation Institute's Center for International Intelligent Transportation Research. The center was mandated to conduct research in three main areas, border crossings, air quality, and traffic operations. As we know, just-in-time is a system under which many manufacturing operations work and uh, reliability of the supply chain is extremely important. The research we're conducting is helping establish technologies that will provide the information to the users about the actual current border crossing times at the different border crossings that will allow users to make a decision based on the border crossing time at a different facility and then they, uh, be able to choose the facility with the least border crossing time. We have also conducted research looking at options to use mass transit to cross people uh, in a more expedited and secure way, the same way that an airport terminal works. You check in, take your plane, and then arrive in your destination in the other country, go through customs, and, and, and you're in. El Paso is an area that, for a number of reasons, is considered by the Environmental Protection Agency a non-attainment area. We are located between mountains, and uh, we also have very windy season during the spring, and we have dust storms. Some of our research is aimed at estimating the level of pollutants that can be attributed to mobile or transportation sources and segregating it from pollution caused by other causes, such as uh, nature or industry. El Paso is a perfect location for a research center that deals with uh, border crossing issues. About $70 billion worth of trade go across the border between El Paso and Ciudad Juarez every year. It's critical for the economy of the state and the economy of the country. <laughs>